everybody. It's almost time. Thought I would just pop in while I play with these settings. Did everybody go and check your name to make sure your name is on the list? I recognize a few names. Vicki, is your name on the list? I just, off the top of my head, I don't remember you being on there. I know Dinky Craft is. Amanda. I think Amanda is, but did everybody go and look? See, now my banner is gone. I had that nifty banner up there. Let me put that back up there. <laughs> Where's my nifty banner? Here it is. Show. There. That's the nifty banner. Hi, Michelle. Hey, Dan. Hey, Chris. Flip flops. I know your name's on the list. I remember seeing it just now. Hey, Lori. Um, okay. So the way the screen is right now. Hi, Diane. With the little bit smaller bingo. How does that look? Does that look okay to everybody? Let me see. Let me pull, let me have it pull a number. And then you tell me what you think. Do you like that? Hey, Deb. Hi, Angela. Hi, Peppermint. Hello, Nancy. In the bag. So what do you think? Is this okay? It looks okay? Because the other option is this. See, it's just like at the eye doctor. Can you see this better? Or can you see this better? So we like the bigger one better. Okay. That's fine. Nobody wants to look at me anyway. Karen, Tammy, Crochet, I know your name's on the list. I just saw that. New numbers, Tracy. Uh, the only numbers I'm going to have is what you put in the August video. Okay. So what you need to do, see that thing across the top? You need to go down into the description box and there's a list of everybody's name. If your name is not in that list, I do not have numbers for you. Uh, when did you send me an email, Karen? Did you send it to the Robin B? Or not Robin B, the um, Roaming with Rover? Let me see. Let's see. Mail. Yes. I did get that, and I responded to you. In fact, I mailed it out today. Nope, that's not what I want. I want this. I want this. Let me double check real quick to make sure it's not hiding anybody's numbers. I have checked this and checked this and checked this a thousand times just to make sure, but I don't trust it. Not for one second. Comments. Held for review. Nothing. So there's nothing that in theory, there's nothing. Okay, Dana, we'll keep an eye on your numbers. I have my lovely assistant tonight.
Karen, what you need to do is go to the, there's a link in the description, takes you to the video. Thank you, Chris. There's a link in the description, which takes you to the video. You need to put your numbers in there. Pick your nine numbers. So, if you have not already done so for, for this month's numbers, if you've done them at the beginning of the month, they're good for the whole month. Ah, I'm trying to get to this thing. Every time I touch it, it goes somewhere else. Live chat. Lots of thummies already. Okay. No numbers have been drawn. I'm just looking. I just put that up there for us to look and see how the screen looks. No numbers have been drawn. We're still trying to figure out all the details here. And everybody, please go down into the description. Make sure your name is on that list. If your name is not on that list, I do not have your numbers. Al, yes. Okay. That shut off. Now, who was just asking me? JSP. Okay, Karen. Yeah, Karen, your name's on there. You're good. We've got almost 100 names on there, so it's not possible for me to call the names out like we did before. So just go into that description box. When you say just, Amanda, if I have everything that I have is in within the last 15 minutes. Okay, let me look. Uh, <laughs> How do I find it? How do I find it? Okay. Oh, there are several new numbers in here. Okay. Amanda and Michelle, I have your numbers. Do you see those? Um, on... They're new ones under the, in the um, YouTube video. Amanda Phillips and Michelle Underwood. Okay. I'm giving you guys the heart right now. So Amanda Phillips and Michelle Underwood, I have yours. Hey, Michelle Mosaic and more. You guys, I got something really special to tell you about in a little while. Me and Michelle have something cooking. You're going to want to know about this. Sue, your name's not on the list because you, I just now got them from you. So... If I'm getting your things right now, Amanda, Michelle, and Sue, your name will not be on that list. I just now am putting them on my spreadsheet, and you are good to go. Davida, I do not have your numbers. Last week, when you put your numbers in, you only gave me one number. Yes, pick live chat. Does somebody know? I don't seem to have the option to pick live chat or top chat in my live. If somebody knows if I'm doing that right or wrong. Awesome, Dana. Dana's got airplanes landing on top of her. I And I've touched all the buttons and I don't see an option. I know when I'm watching it on a regular um, issue, I mean, a regular... Uh, like my tablet or my phone or something, I have that option. But on my live, I don't see that option. Hey, Laura, so far so good. If I... So I'm hoping I'm not missing anybody's comments. I can't find Michelle. She's the second from the top. Did you put it... Oh. Do you put it under newest? 
Put your list comment list under newest. Let's see. Oh, that would be helpful. That's really helpful. See, I'm supposed to know more. No, no. You are amazing. <laughs> you are amazing. You almost always know more than me. It's just once in a while I have fumbled across something. Yeah. <laughs> oh, hey, Angela. Hi, Taylor. If I would have been smart, I would have printed out a copy of that for myself. Um. Okay, so Amanda, Michelle, and Sue, we are writing your numbers in, so you are good. You will not be on the list in the description box, but I have I have you now. Hey, Karen, have you put your numbers in before? If not, you need to... Do I have any mods in here other than Dana, who's driving and can't do anything? I'm in here. Can you drop our link to go in and to this video so they can go in and pick their numbers? Yeah. Okay, so Karen, okay, okay. I'm gonna go over all the rules for everybody. Terry, I should have your numbers. Are they in the list? So first, I want everybody to go in the description box in this video and see if the name, if your name is on that list. If it is, I have your numbers. Morgan just dropped the link. So if you are new and have not played before, you need to go to that link, the one that Morgan just dropped, go to that link and put pick nine numbers between the numbers one and 75. Okay, Terry, go to that video and put in your numbers. Morgan's keeping track of that video. And as the new numbers come up, she will, um, she'll put it in our list. Okay. So go into that video. I'm going to wait a minute. We're going to, we're going to just chit chat for a few minutes while y'all get settled. Whoops. Get myself settled over here. I'm going to turn this a little bit. There we go. So we're keeping an eye on that. And as the names come in, and she indicates to me we've got them, I will heart your comment. So Terry, I'm not seeing it yet. I will heart your comment and then you'll know that I received your, your comments. Karen, your name is your name on the list? I thought it was. I swear I just looked at that. Yeah, Karen, your name should be on the list. Karen JSP, your name is on this. Davida, I do not have your numbers. Are you kidding me? You put your numbers in? I had double and triple and quadruple checked. There's nothing hidden. Whose numbers are you looking for? Um, Danita? Remember? Put one yeah, last week we got one number. You are not in here. And I have checked the help for review. I have checked everything. Do it for me one more time right now, Davida. And if it doesn't show up in there, we'll just take your numbers. I don't know why it hates you. Okay, Christina Curry, your numbers just came in. Karen Port, your numbers just came in. Hey, Jennifer. Thank you, Jennifer. I swear it's not me. I don't know why. Uh, I don't know why YouTube hates me. That's why I came up with this list. So we would know if your numbers are not in my comment section, I do not have them. So we can get that figured up right here. Yeah, I thought it was holding them for review, but I've checked that multiple times too. Karen, ABQ only has seven numbers. Oh, uh, that might be me. Let's double check it. 
Okay. Ten seconds ago. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see what we got here. Held for review. Published. Held for review. Christina Curry. It held yours for review. Ta da da. I think that makes you special or something. Christina. Okay, I just approved them. So now that should go onto the list. Re Dick. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Karen, I need nine numbers, not seven. Karen, ABQ, I need nine numbers. Yeah, don't just list your numbers. Say something, even if it's just hello. No, I'm not adding names to the list right now. I'm just telling you, if I have received your numbers, the list is already in there. It's before we started the live. I'm not adding them to the list now. I'm telling you I have your numbers, and you should be receiving a heart from your comment. And it shows up pretty darn quick, that heart does. Okay. Oh, Ellen B., I just got your numbers. You are good to go. Karen ABQ, I have your numbers. Terry's Treasures, I have your numbers. Christina Curry, I have your numbers. They've been released by the YouTube police. Amanda Phillips, I have your numbers. Michelle and Sue, all of you guys, I have your numbers. Your name will not show up on the list ne this week. Next week, I will add them to that list. Poor Miss Morgan is over there writing as fast as she can. <laughs> She's scribbling your numbers as quick as she can. Um, Dana's driving. We want her to stay safe. So Miss Morgan will watch her numbers. Hi, Nancy. Nancy, did you double check the list to make sure your name, your numbers are in here? Okay, so once we can, oh my goodness. Thank you. Woohoo. Thank you. Super chat. Thank you so much. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Just so you guys know, any super chats we get on here goes to help pay for postage and prizes. Because I'll tell you what, y'all know postage is a thing these days. So, thank you, thank you, thank you. I can't believe that I'm so excited. I'm supposed to figure out how to make some kind of little thing so it dances or does something for you. Yeah. Y'all know me. That ain't happening. This is as good as it gets. <laughs> I can't even get the numbers to work in this thing. <laughs> All right. That's right, Amber. She's just preparing for the bingo she's going to win. You might have to arm wrestle Dana for that. Although if we do it while she's driving, right? Yeah, her name's on the list. It's under um, Fostering Crochet. There's Davida's. We got your numbers, Davida. Yeehaw! You also are out of YouTube jail. Okay, as soon as you quit writing, I want to go through and heart these when I confirm that you've got the numbers. Okay, so the way the game works, thank you so much, Amber. The way the game works, in theory, I have your nine numbers. You would go into this video the the august video and you will pick nine numbers between the numbers of one and 75. uh-oh amber's amber's handing out mickey's tonight watch out in one and 75 okay when you see i've got it loaded there it's going to pick the numbers and it'll flash them on the screen, just like that one number that's flashing. The first two games you match five of the numbers you picked. If you cannot remember your numbers, go back into the comment from that video and your numbers. Okay. Once 
you match those five numbers. Okay, Dina, we're just going over the rules still. Dina, go into the description box and make sure your name is on that list. Okay, make sure your name is on that list. That's how we're going to tell that I've got your numbers. And everybody will watch because I always, you know, got 2,500 things going on. My internet, I've reset my thing and now it's showing me one bar. So we're going to hope that this keeps working. Worst case, if you guys lose me, if you lose me, watch for Morgan. She'll put the numbers up so we can keep going. Okay. So watch for Morgan. And then when it comes up, you'll still be able to see your numbers. Numbers? We need nine. I know. Okay. She Kay. says she fixed them, but I can't see it on my end. Karen ABQ, you fixed your numbers in here. Let me find it. Seems like that should move it to the top, but maybe not. Okay, I gotta find it. So you're going to match five numbers. You're gonna say bingo. The first one to say bingo wins that game. Only one winner per game. And it's the first one on my end. Sorry, Teensy. I see that it took you several times. There's Karen JSP. Okay. Uh, the last two numbers she put on there, 63 and 72. For Karen ABQ. Oh, sorry. That's JSP. Oh. That's why we're getting That's why we're getting confused. <laughs> There's a lot of Karens. Did she put them in? I think they're in the chat. Um, yeah, I'm not seeing. So if Karen wants to drop the last two numbers in the chat. Karen, what's the initial? ABQ. Karen, ABQ, please show me your last two numbers. Just she said chat. it's in the link. Just put it right here in the chat so we can get this taken care of. Yeah, your name's not on the list because we're just now doing your numbers. Yeah, that's the only one I'm waiting on. And then we're good to go, I think. Okay. So I have Davida, correct? Yes. Okay, I'm hearting hers and B. So listen, your name right now. If your name, I have a number. We'll show up in the list. Okay. Here's the turn. Okay. I see people right I have her number. You will not show up in the yeah, I know. Karen, have your number. No. Okay. I'm back. Right now, you're looking for a beautiful face. So we can see what's going on. Am I back, you guys? Am I back? Oh, I think you're back now. Woohoo! Okay, how do I get this off? I'm trying to get this thingy off so we can see what's going on. 
Okay. So I'm going to do one more overview of everything. If you lose me, bingo, you don't have to have problems on my end. Just like that. If the screen goes out black, Morgan will post your number. Let's do a test. Morgan, please post 55. Okay, God is going to lose if you lose me, and we can keep playing as long as I still have the bingo game because it, it's doing its thing too. So, Morgan's going to post the number just like that. Okay. Can you see me? I'm pointing at the comments so y'all can see. <laughs> okay. All right. So that way we can keep playing without being, um, oh my gosh, it's so hot. I get, Hang on. You guys, I got to turn the fan on. I'm dying here. One second. You got, okay. Thanks, Mark. Okay. So that way we can still keep playing without relying on the internet. So. Karen, we have all of your numbers, both Karens. Test worked, perfect. Okay, so we're going to start the numbers. Don't pay attention to the letter. There was a lot of confusion last week because they couldn't see the letter. The letter means nothing. Oh, thank you so much, Laura. So it's just the numbers that we're worried about. So when you match the first five, first of your five numbers that match, shout bingo, 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 bingo. And the first one with bingo wins the prize. Only one winner per game. And it's based on the comments in my feed. I know sometimes your guys' feed looks different than what our feed does. If somebody comes in late and the game has already started, as long as your numbers are listed, you're fine. You can jump in anytime. As long as we have your numbers. Okay. All right. The third game is blackout. We start over with each game with all of the numbers. So we start with a fresh, clean bingo board with every game. Okay. Is everybody ready to start? Miss Dana, are you ready? You know, as she always says, she's going to win anyway. So there's no point in anybody else even playing. But it sounds like she's got some competition tonight with Amber. Right. Feeds do not always match. That's correct. And I know there was some confusion. Um, I think it was last week. Somebody had thought they had won. Oh, speaking of which, speaking of which, if we get either of these two people in here tonight, I need you to contact me. I am looking for Diane Dorrance and Saf Stitches. I need you guys to send me an email. Diane Dorrance and Saf Stitches. If y'all are in here at any point tonight, we need an email. Actually, what you need to do is you need to contact Miss Amber so you can get your prize. She doesn't have a mailing address for you. Okay. All right. Here we go. Get back up here and Diane. clear. I thought there's Diane. I told her you all to be in here tonight. We're going to clear the board. Reset. So y'all can see what I'm doing here. Confirm. Get up here and make sure you can see the numbers. Start the new game. And 67. There's your first number. 67. 67. Woohoo, Dana's got a number. 20 more miles for Dana, and then she'll be done for the day. 67. Number eight. Number eight. See if I can set this up over here. Then I don't have to have multiple things going. Number eight. 19. 
one nine nineteen. Number nineteen. All right, a couple people getting numbers. All right, all right. Oh, hey, KB. Dana says we've got one of her numbers. Oh, 67. See, we're going strong already. Mama Sue's got a number. 19. I love this so you guys can see the numbers that have been called too. 71. 71. Oh, I have got big news for you guys. I am so excited. We got something planned. We'll talk about it at the end of the first game. Super excited. 71. Gosh, we got so many people in here tonight. That is so fun. Wow, wow, wow. Two number. Terry's got two. Woo-hoo! Yep, KB, we just barely got started. We've been trying to get all the, everybody having their numbers figured out and figuring out the rules. And KB, I need to make sure that you go down into the description under this and make sure your name is on that list. KB Fibers, I haven't looked, I didn't look real close at the list today. Do we have her? Yes. Okay, you're good, KB. Your name's on the list. And Taylor LT, Verna, I know yours is. I know. I'm so excited. 62, 62. Does that seem to be, I'm just, you know, every week it seems like we're trying to come up with a new way to confirm that you guys, the information is getting from you through the internet world, through the YouTube world, and to me. Does this seem like a reasonable way to do it? That you guys know, just go look on that list. And if your name's there, we're golden. And if not, let me know. Does that seem like a reasonable way to do this? We're trying whatever we can think of to get this information across. The list does it. Okay, good. People are loving the list. Okay, good, 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 good. Nice, nice. And they won't always be in alphabetic order because once I put it in there, it won't let me rearrange anything. So we'll just add names to the bottom of it. Oh, thank you so much, Jennifer. I, it's, it's not even that it's hard work. It's just confusing because something that seems so simple doesn't work. That's what's annoying about it all. 14, 1, 4. 14. Hey, Arlene. I didn't see you pop in. You're not late. We're just barely getting started. And I know your name's on the list. So all you got to do is look at the numbers and catch up. No, Karen, yours is not going to be on the list. The ones that I read out right before we started, I can't add to the list while we're playing. So you'll... Yours will show up next week, but I have confirmed with you that we have your numbers. Both Karens, ABQ, right? Yep. Yes. We have both Karen and then letters. <laughs> okay, number 14, one, four. Thirty-nine, three, nine. Thirty-nine. We got a nice mix of numbers. Whew. We had a busy day. I did not sleep last night. Usually, the second my head hits the pillow, I'm out. I was laying there. It was it was almost 1 o'clock in the morning last time I noticed my clock. And then I woke up at 4.30 because I kept thinking of all these things that needed to be done. And I made list after list after list today. I did get a lot of things done, but... Man, I was stressing. I was definitely stressing last night. I was really, there's just so much going on. There's so many things. Yes, Karen, play, 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 play. 
We have your numbers. You are good to go. You are good to go. Number one. Number one. Number one. Yeah, Laura, that's what we're going to do. We had just, uh, we just started over fresh in August. So your numbers are going to be good for sure for August and September. And just so you guys know, I'm going to give you a heads up right now. Nobody knows about this yet. I'm not going to be here in the month of October. There's no bingo, no, no, um, no interview, no guest interviews in October. I'm going to be traveling and there's going to be content. I'm, and that's one of the things I was worried about last night is um, getting stuff for y'all. But and there's pop-up lives. They won't be scheduled because I have no idea what my internet's going to be like. Okay. So, so you know, no bingo in the month of October. So your number is going to be good for August and September. Right. Did I see somebody needed one more number? That cannot be right. Really? And truly? Is there no, Tracy Purdue. Tracy, what? you want one number with eight numbers and you got four of them? Is that correct? And you better give her a mix right quick. Here we go. Number two. Number two. Okay, that must have been one of her numbers. <laughs> 72. Number 72. Taking a few seconds for it to show up. 43. Hmm. Oh, there we go. Oh, wow. I just had about 20 messages pop in. Yes, five, Tracy. <laughs> oh, the bingo game is buffering. Oh, the whole thing is buffering. Okay. Yeah, because I'm like, how come my numbers aren't showing up on the screen? Okay, 43. <laughs> Dana says she has one number. She wins. Hey, Frog. You can jump in anytime, but I think somebody's just about ready to win this one. Dana? Yeah, Dana with one number. 37, 37. 43 just popped up on here. Three, seven. There we go. Frog, make sure you go in and look in the description box and see if your name's on the list. That's how we're confirming that I have your numbers. I'm pretty sure I do, though. Three, seven. Thirty-eight. Three, eight. Three, 
three eight. Yes, I'm sorry, Crystal. I don't know why it has to do this. Morgan's going to keep putting those numbers up. For some reason, her internet is better than the the house internet. <laughs> Morgan's roaming. Awesome. <laughs> Thirty-eight. Dana still has one number, and she still thinks she wins, and she's still wrong. <laughs> so, what did y'all do today? Anything exciting? I had a meeting. That wasn't exciting. Thirty-five. Three, five. I have a monthly meeting. Actually, it's twice a month. And twice a month we go there and talk about the same things we talked about at the last meeting. And nobody ever accomplishes anything. And it's very frustrating to me. Ooh, that's fun, Dean. Hang out with your granddaughter. That's the best. Yeah, nice try, Dana. Nice try. They don't even feed us at that meeting. If they would feed me, I would feel like at least I accomplished something. No food. Ooh, went on our daughter's boat. Oh, somebody had teeth filled. Icky. Terry's working on a shawl. All right, Laura, this is the highlight of your day. Boy, that's a lot of pressure on me. That is a lot of pressure on me. It's all right, Carly. We're still on the first game. Carly, go into the description box. Make sure your your name is on that list. Oh, we're confirming you. You don't even have to go in there. You're good. So just look at the numbers on the board here and catch up. Oh, no. Melanie's grandma died today. Oh, no, that's going to make me cry. I'm so sorry. Well, let's hope that uh, maybe you'll win a little prize today to make you feel a little bit better. That's so sad. I'm so sorry. I keep reminding my kids that I am the matriarch of the family now. And I ain't going anywhere for a long time. So sorry for you. Seventy-five, seven, five. Seventy-five. Oh, I appreciate that, Melanie. I understand. I understand. Sometimes it's just it's just better to be with some friends. All right, Jennifer got one. Woohoo! <laughs> Chris says it's not looking good. Denise has three. <gasps> oh, Mama lost her dog. Sabrina, you're fine. We're still on the first game. Is she on the list? Sabrina, can we just confirm her real quick? Sabrina Aguilera. I know. Yes. Okay, Sabrina, you're good. Your numbers are good. Um, so you can, you can still play as long as you can check the board and make sure your numbers are good or see if you have any numbers. I, I understand wanting to be with, with friends and have something like this to take your mind off when we lost Miss Sophie a few weeks ago, not that it compares to losing your grandma, but when we lost Miss Sophie a few weeks ago, what got me through the day was going 
and listening to Amber's videos. She just made me laugh for a couple hours and it just kind of brought me out of my funk for the day. So I understand that. Fifty-one, five, one. Fifty-one. <laughs> I think we got a lot of people with one number that think that should be enough to win. Dana, see what you've started? Fifty-one. We've had 16 numbers drawn. And I know we got a couple people close. I know we have one person with four on. Do we have anybody else with four on? Fifty-one. Thank you. Um Deanne, go look in the drop down box, look in the description box, and see if your name is on that list. Yep, I see you in there. D, Needle and Hook Burrow. I see you on the list. Ooh, okay. So rude. <laughs> so rude. Uh, Max is uh, pushing his way around in here, shoving people around. <laughs> Forty-four. Four, four. This is a match five round. Four, four. Oh, KB only needs five more. <laughs> Dana, are you done driving for today? He wants to play. <laughs> 64. 6 4. There we go. 6 4. I know we're right on the Oh, I see a bingo. Bingo, bingo, bingo. Sandra. Sandra Sinok. Bingo, bingo. All right. Let's see here. Let's check your numbers. Let's check your numbers. All right. We got to do this. We got to go over here. You got to put up your name so I don't lose track of you. Where are you? Where are you? Nope, it's past that. What was it, Sandra? Yeah, Sandra. She's got a bingo. I checked it. Okay. Okay. Let's read out the numbers. All right. One. One. Eight. Eight. Ten. No. Fourteen. Yes. Thirty. No. 34. No. 46. No. 62. Yes. 64. Yes. Bingo. It's a good bingo. Woohoo. Woohoo. Right. We have our first, first bingo. Okay. Our first. Tammy, you shouldn't have changed your number. <laughs> I'm sorry, Tracy. I'm sorry. Yay, Sandra. Okay, what did she win? Let me see if I can reach it. <laughs>
Do you, Sandra, do you like one weight yarn? Let me know. Let me know. Do you like one weight? Oh, Jennifer, I'm so sorry. Only the first one wins. The first bingo wins. Sandra, do you like one weight yarn? Just the first bingo wins. Yes, Amber, I know you like one weight. Too bad you didn't win. Okay, not your favorite. That's okay. I have a different item. We've got some Ogo yarn. This is the Ogo Red Heart Super Saver Tangle Free Quick Start. This is your basic four weight. This is a five ounce skein, roll, ball. I don't know what to call it. Hoop. It's a five ounce container. <laughs> five ounce container. Um, no dye lot, machine washable and dryable. It's got the Oco Tech standard. So they've tested it for all the bazillion of things that'll kill you in yarn. I didn't know there were so many bad things in yarn until they came out with that. Made in Turkey. We love the made in Turkey yarn. Woohoo, woohoo. 100% acrylic. So no wools were killed to make this yarn. Imported and distributed. What else is on here that you want to know? You don't care. It's yarn. It's your basic four weight red heart yarn. It's actually, it feels nice. It, it doesn't feel like, um, it feels really nice. Nicer than normal. And it's thick. It says it's a four, but man. That's a thick four. I'm calling this four and a half. Anywho, if you haven't used this before, you take it out of the little container and it's hooked together at the top. Can you see that? And you just clip that and then it pops open and then you can pull your yarn and it, it does not tangle. We don't, we have no yarn barf. This is non yarn barf yarn. That's what they claim. I haven't used it yet. But I've seen many, many people, and um, no, everybody has said it does not. Okay? No, no um, yarn barf in this. And this is kind of cool. There's a thing on the back, one of those QR code doohickeys. You pull that up, and you'll get a bazillion patterns. I love, I'm all about the patterns. So let's see here. What do, we, what do you have to do to receive this prize? What you have to do is send an email to me by next Sunday to this winner's only email address. Only winner, winners use this because, you know, I was getting all the emails and they were getting lost in the shuffle. So this way, I'm only getting a handful in there. I can keep track of when I've sent things out. If you don't respond by next Sunday, you lose. It starts over and the, pile, and the gift goes back in the pile. I have all prizes have been sent out at this point, other than what we're doing tonight. So I am completely caught up. I don't know how that happened. Let me tell you. I do not know how that happened. Speaking of yarn barf, I'll leave that up for a minute so you've got a chance to write that down. Uh, according to Nightbot, you can type the word drop. And the first one... It doesn't, we won't do all of them. It picks and chooses. Yes, you're going to use your same numbers for the whole month of August and September. August and September. I know, Karen. Maybe that's why I'm not, I didn't sleep last night. I just keep thinking of all these things I have to do. Okay, we'll see if that's going to work. I'm so happy for you. I'm so excited. There we go. Tracy, yours popped in. It seems to pick and choose who is going to drop when you when you ask it to. Nightbot is very particular. All right, let's clear this out. Oh, so let's clear this out. And then I'm going to tell you the big news. The big news. Let's see. Clear this out. Um, before we get into the big news, can we check the help for review? Yes. For Karen? Yes. We will check the help for review as soon as I can get this thing to slow down so we can do what it needs to do. 
reset the board, dink, confirm. Okay, y'all can see we're at zero numbers. Okay, we're checking the held for review. Comments held for review. We have nothing held for review. Nothing held for review. Is there somebody who's got missing numbers? Yeah. Karen Fort. I'm just going to have her put them in the chat. Lori, that's so funny. It Nightbot held your message. I don't know why. You know, somebody said, okay, I don't have it set, but the other day somebody told me that if you put several emojis in there, that it was holding it for review, that Nightbot was holding it. And I know I've got that set so you can have like 50 of them. So I don't know why it's doing that. So just don't put more than, let's say, two and see if that makes it happy. Because Doris, it was fine with yours, but Lori, it held yours, and you have three. So, which Karen? Karen Port. Karen Port. Um. Karen, just pick some numbers. Just, just throw some numbers on the screen right now. We'll get you on the list. You don't need to leave. We can accommodate. We can accommodate. Oops, now I've lost my screen. That's not good. Get back up here where you belong. Make you big like you're supposed to be. Oh, thank you, Laura. Are you okay? You got Jennifer's numbers? Okay, Jennifer, we have your numbers. You're good. Karen, throw some numbers up there. Did we not have Jennifer from before? No. Okay. So we'll get we'll get you on the list next. Your your name will show up on the list next week, Jennifer. Jennifer Red. I just want everybody to have fun. This is all about fun. You know, we're we're communicating a little bit. We're getting our mind off the world for a little bit. There's Karen's numbers. Six, seven, whoops, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Lori, there, it liked you. It liked you this time. Oh, yes. That's what it, is. it didn't like. I'll bet you're right. It counted out. But I don't know why it even did that because I do not have it set. I love the emojis. I think they're now see Lori, Laura E put a bunch in. So who knows? Who knows? Computers. I give up. I give up. Yeah, I just want everybody to have a bunch of fun. Okay, Michelle, Michelle, I'm so excited. Shall we tell everybody what's going to happen, Michelle? So excited. Okay, this is. This is excitement for me and Michelle. Excited. Okay. So, yes, we're still using August numbers. We're going to use August numbers for the entire month of August and September. Yeah, Nightbot, boy, you got that right. It is picky and weird. Okay. So, this is so exciting. Okay. Okay. I feel like a little kid now. Are you ready? Are you ready? Wait. How many of you have wanted to do a mosaic crochet project, but like me, you are terrified to try it? Yes. Terrified to try it because it looks really, really hard. And I can follow, I can read a pattern. I can read a chart. I can follow instructions. But when I am stuck on something, 
I need to ask somebody for help. Even watching the most bestest of videos, and there's some great videos out there, you guys. Even watching the best of videos still doesn't answer my question. Still doesn't show me where exactly I'm supposed to put the hook. Or what does this thing right here mean? Or help me fix what I have messed up. So, Michelle Mosaics and more and I are going to try something new. She has agreed to try to teach me, try to teach me mosaic crochet live. So we're going to do a series of two live events on August 17 and August 31st. We'll tell you exactly what you need to do. I'll be putting out a video in a day or two telling you exactly what you need to have. We want you guys all to come and play with us and follow along. The whole point is, I don't know what I'm doing. I can ask her questions. You can ask the questions while you're here live. And to make it even more interesting, Miss Morgan is going to be on panel with us. So you've got somebody who... I've crocheted for years and I still muddle through things. Morgan has been crocheting for a few weeks and she's going to pop up here and learn as well. So this is going to be perfect for anybody who's ever wanted to learn mosaic crochet. Now let me show you what we're going to be making. Let me see if this shows up on screen. Tell me if this shows up good. Can you see? How's that? Yeah, that looks good. Okay, that looks good. this is what we're going to make. This is called the Apache Tears, and you don't even need a pattern. Okay, no pattern required. Just follow along with us, and you'll figure this out. Now, see all those strings on the ends? This is one of the things that's kept me from doing mosaic crochet. Well, guess what? There's no weaving in of the ends with mosaic. She's got magic that she's going to teach us where we don't have to weave in all the ends. I'm super excited about this. Super, super excited. So we're going to do it over the course of two weeks. The first week, she'll teach us the beginnings of it. And then once we get, we'll have that figured out and come back two weeks later, that'll give you a chance to get as big as you want to get it. Then she's going to teach us the magic of... Um, the ends, the non-weaving in of ends. You guys, I am so excited about this. I'm thrilled, thrilled, thrilled. Nope, no special hook. I'll tell you right now, this is all you need. This is all you need. You need two skeins of yarn. Four weight is best. You want colors that are, um, what's the word that I want? Where you can really see the difference, contrasting, contrasting colors. It's best if you don't use black or dark color because you guys know it's hard to see those. Whatever hook matches your yarn and you need a pair of scissors. That's it. That's all the supplies you're going to need for this. Um, I just saw somebody pop up and said they're going to be out of town. Oh, there, you're going to be on holiday, Dinky. That's okay. It's going to be a live. So you can go back and watch the replay and then you'll be ready to go for the second round. Contrasting colors. Thank you, KB. Thank you. It's going to be the 17th of August. And we're going to do what time? Five, four, four o'clock Pacific. So that's six o'clock central. Isn't that right, Michelle? Isn't that what we decided? No, Doris, we do not tuck the ends in as you go. And Melanie, that's gonna be that's gonna be the next month. In September, we're gonna make the little purse. We're gonna make a uh, like a notions bag. Super, super excited about this. So it's gonna be Wednesday, August 17th, and then Wednesday, August 31st. I want to say it's four o'clock Pacific, but I'm gonna have a video come out here in a day or two. It'll have the exact time. Yes, Michelle's saying four o'clock Pacific. Okay, so just grab any two. We're, we're basically, we're going to make a little mug rug size. 
just to get you used to doing it. And I just thought that would be so much fun because, you know, so many times, just like with the whole sock debacle, I want somebody here that I can ask questions of while I'm messing it up that can show me what I'm doing. So yeah, we're going to do, we're going to get the basics down in, in August. And then in September, we're going to make a notions bag and we'll let you know what materials you need for the motions bag at the end of the, the August shows. Okay. Uh, you can get the notions bag. Anyway, we'll tell you about it later. That's, that's inexpensive to do as well. So super, super excited. I'm so happy that Michelle is going to, is um, up for this challenge, teaching Morgan and I. I'm pretty sure Morgan will catch on faster than I will because that's how she rolls. You ought to see how she's doing. She's so amazing. She's doing such a good job on this stuff. So mark your calendars for the 17th and the 31st. It's going to be a live. You'll get, you'll see the notifications. And I'm going to put, this is going to, if it doesn't go away, I think this is the picture that I'm going to use for the live. So you'll know that's the live for that. Okay. Does that work out for everybody? Super exciting. Yeah, I really like the idea of, you know, so many of us miss having somebody that sits with them and shows them what to do and shows them how to do it and shows them the little tips and tricks. And, you know, when we used to learn this stuff from our grandma or from our auntie, that's what we're missing out on. Yes, Tammy, that's why I'm doing it a little bit earlier in the day for Pacific. So it's 4 o'clock Pacific, so that's going to be 7 Eastern. So not too late. We we really were, we were thinking about that when we were setting the time frames. So watch for the video that's going to come out this week. And um, yeah, I know, Taylor, this is going to be real exciting. Super, super exciting. Should be, I think Eastern is three hours later than us. Yeah, it's three hours later. So four o'clock Pacific, seven Eastern, six Central. Yes. Right. There's no guidance and there's nobody to say, oh, that's not quite right. Let me show you exactly. Let me show you exactly how to do this. And when you've messed up, usually you can just show somebody and they'll go, oh, this is easy. You pull this out and this is all you did wrong. That's what I'm looking for. And if this goes well, if if I'm not a complete dork during this, we'll come up with some other things too that we can do. I'm thinking of, of a series and we're going to call it, hey, can you teach me this? Or can you teach me how? And then different things. Okay. Oh, Dana, that would be... Five o'clock, depending on what type, part of Idaho you are in. Because I know in Boise, they are an hour later. See, you thought you were going to stump me, Miss Dana. You did not. All right. Are we ready to play game two? Game two. Oh, Teach me. Oh, no. Whack-a-mole, whack-a-mole. Yeah, what do we do? What do we, did somebody get him? Get him, get him. Block. Oh, it let me block it. Okay. It let me block it. Troll alert. Okay, y'all be on the lookout for troll alerts. Yes, Doris. It, um, if you, I'm up at the top by the neck. And that's all the same time zone as me. It doesn't change till we hit Montana. But down at the bottom, it changes about halfway through. Christina, that's what I'm thinking. Christina Curry, how to read patterns, how to read charts, how to read graphs. You know what I want to know how to do? And I cannot do it. And I know a lot of people can. And that's the other reason that I was thinking about this. You know how you do that? When you're doing the chain and you're doing the single crochet or the double crochet at the same time that you're doing the chain. I want to learn how to do that. I've done it a couple of times and I'm struggling with it. And I want somebody to actually show me where I can see if I'm doing it wrong or doing it right. Yep. Whack-a-troll, whack-a-troll. Hey, 
Did this tell you? Yeah, foundation. That's it. Thank you, Arlene. Did this tell you that you had to be a member? You had to be a subscriber in order to um, comment? I thought I set that up the other day in order to deal with the trolls. Hmm. Okay. We'll just have to be watching for what we'll play whack a troll. All righty. Okay. Um, when I do the next ones, I'll go in and set that. I don't think I can do it in the middle of a game. Um, I, I must, I must have to set it every time. And what I'm going to do then is I'll set it for five minutes. So you have to be a subscriber for five minutes. And then that helps with these, with these bots. So okie dokie. Okay, Karen, Karen's not a member and it's letting you post. So we're going to do that next. Um, I'll get that for the next time. So in order to help avoid them, um, And then we'll play whack-a-mole again. I thought being the bots, it would help keep them out. I'm so sorry. Ugh. Okay. All right. Are we ready? Be watching for whack-a-mole, whack-a-troll. And here we go with game two. Start a new game. Boom. 68. 6-8. Six, Sixty-eight. Jennifer, your numbers just popped up on my screen. <laughs> That's funny. Six-eight. Dana, did you win yet? 16, 1, 6, 16. Get this so I can see what I'm doing here. 1, 6. I'm so excited. Not only am I excited about the mosaic, I'm excited that Morgan's going to be on panel and y'all will get to watch her too. And it was even her idea. I didn't even twist her arm to make her do this one. Poor thing, I'm always volunteering her for stuff. Volunteer, voluntold. Volunteer, voluntold, yep. Okay, one, six. Now remember, the first bingo wins. Only one winner per game. 50, five, zero. 50. Tomorrow morning, we have our special guest is going to be Christy from Yarn Barf. Super excited to meet Christy, find out what makes her tick. I uh, see Jennifer, I struggled with the star stitch because if you don't put your hook in the exact right spot, it's off the whole thing. <laughs> yeah. Morgan's been drafted. Oh, good idea, Taylor. Those would be awesome. Hey, Cam, we just this second started the second game. Make sure we've got your, your numbers. Go in and, and check the description box. Make sure your name's on the list. Five zero. <laughs> Thirty eight. Three eight. Yeah, the important thing is to make sure that your colors are contrasting so you can really see the difference in the colors. And ombre is beautiful for one of the colors. But I would stay away from like a black or a dark, dark brown, anything like that while we're learning. By the time you get to your 
uh, tapestry little bag, I think you'll be fine with the black. And it looks gorgeous. The black looks gorgeous with um, like, like neon ombre. Beauteous. Three, eight. 63. Six, three. 63. Now I'm told in theory, you can use any weight you want, but it's really tricky. Not tricky. It's as a beginner, you're, it's going to be a lot better for you if you start with a, um, a four weight. Counting, 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 yeah. Kim, you don't have your numbers in at all? We're checking the chart. Checking the chart. Okay, pop over and get your numbers in there right now. Then you can play the third game. Oh, come and play with us, Kim. Come and play. The link to the video is in the description. Nope, the yarn can be anything you want. Um, if you want to... Okay, I'm making a mug rug out of mine. And so, yeah, in theory, cotton is the best. But I I'm not drinking anything. My cups aren't so hot that it's going to melt a um what's the word i want you know it's not going to melt this um acrylic it, nothing i'm drinking is so hot that it's going to melt acrylic and that's what you're worried about with cotton with kitchen cotton that you're using it for a hot pad or you're using it for a pot holder uh you know um But uh, maybe a cotton blend if you want it to absorb some moisture. Maybe a nice cotton blend. I'm not going to worry about that. I just want to make the pretty. Right. You're right, KB. It won't soak, soak that up. I And I don't know. I've done never done it before. So maybe somebody who has done this can tell me. Is working with kitten, kitchen cotton going to be, you know, it doesn't have a lot of give. Is this going to work up okay for, for somebody doing this brand new? 65, 6, 5, 65. Oh, Hobie's got beautiful cotton, Dina. Just beautiful. Hobie's got beautiful everything. I love, love, love their stuff. Yeah, and, and that's the only reason I'm not using the cotton. And maybe I'll do that on my second one, but I just want, I wanted, oh, I just realized my light's not on. Um, I wanted something that I knew would be fairly easy to work with. Hey, look at that. Now I'm not in the dark. Okay, 65. Six, five. So Karen, you're going to want to make sure and subscribe for next week so that because I'm going to put that thing on there to try to help with the trolls. Six, five. I know me and Morgan are going to have to go shopping on my yarn wall. It's funny because her color choices are so different from mine. 60, 6, 0, 6, 0. Thank you, Karen. 6, 0. I'm so excited to, to talk to Chrissy tomorrow. Christy. I hope I didn't spell her name wrong. I think I've got it spelled two different ways in three different places. That's just rude to spell somebody's name wrong when they're your guest. 
All right, Kim. Good job. We'll get your numbers um, on the list, and you'll be good for the next game. You got to play blackout. Kim put her numbers in. Oh, Arlene wants us to shake the numbers up. Here. Maybe that'll help. We'll put a little magic on the, on the screen. Kim, we've got your numbers. You're good to go. Next week, your name will show up on the list. Six, zero. Anybody got any numbers yet? Shake the computer. <laughs> no. <laughs> like one of those um, snowballs where you shake it and the glitter goes all over. Number six. Here we're still the second game, so we're just matching five still. Match five. I thought I saw somebody in my yard. Number six. Anybody doing uh, vlogist? It's hard to keep up with everybody that's doing vloggers. That's a lot of videos to watch. But I'm doing it. I got about three people that I've been keeping up on all of them. Thirty-nine. Three, nine. Thirty-nine. It is a lot. I've got a couple people that um, actually yesterday I went in and just kind of did their whole playlist to, to keep to catch up to them. And that's funny. There's, you know, a whole group of people that I am subscribed to and I know I've got it set to get their notifications. And I, it occurred to me the other day that there was one that I had not seen one of her videos in a long time and I got on to her channel and she's been doing her videos all along and I've missed like probably 20 of her videos. I'm not getting notifications. So even though I have my thing set, I don't think it gives, I think it picks and chooses just like everything else. I think it picks and chooses which videos it's going to tell you about. Yeah. Staff. Oh, yes. Steph, I need you to send an email to Steph and Stitches. I need you to send an email to um, Amber. Amber, can you drop your link so she can find you? You need to give her your address so she can send out your prize. She's got a prize for you. Yeah, Tammy, I've actually finally, um, you know, on my 8 million lists, I've made a list of the two dozen or so. Um, yes, it'll, it'll unsubscribe you too. I have had people that I have followed for years and all of a sudden it shows that I'm not subscribed to them. And I'm like, what the heck? And then I feel bad because I don't want people, I don't want people to think I've unsubscribed to them. Or that I've just now subscribed when I've been following them for, you know, two or three years. There's fostering, fostering yarn at gmail.com. Saf, yes, you, Saf Stitch, right above you. Connect with Miss Amber. She's got a prize for you. You're lucky because I don't let my people go more than a week. Yeah, YouTube does whatever it feels like doing. That's the truth. Number eight. One. I was looking all over the board. I'm like, I know I push the button. Where's the number? Number one. Number one. Yeah, me and technology don't get along. L Lori, it blocked your message again. It absolutely does not like you. 
Yay, Karen got a number. Karen got a number. Oh, Seth. Yeah. Email probably got lost in the lost in the world of of uh, internet. Number one. Number three. Number three. So, Steph, you just need to email Amber. You don't need to email me. <gasps> bingo? What? Vicky's got a bingo. Let's check. No. 63? Yes. 65? Yes. 60. Yes. Yes. Oh. Woo it's a good bingo. Where did it go? Oh. Oh. Yeah, we got to cut Amber a break. She's way sick. So it's easier to just resend. There she is. Miss Vicky. Oh. That was a fast one. There we go. Woo! -hoo! Oh, thank you so much, Deb. Thank you, so Deb. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Woo! Vicky, woo, woo, Deb. Look, we even got we've got the bat wings popping along. Isn't that fun getting old. Good lord. Good lord. Oh, I'm so happy. Good job. Good job. I can't see. Three. 12. Only 12 numbers. That's amazing. absolutely amazing. Let's see. The board. Do this for here. Here and burn. See it. There we go. <laughs> Dave Jennifer gives you permission. I've gone so far. Tiny five. All right, everybody, clear your board. Start a new game. Start a new game. This is the block game. This is the numbers. Yeah. Uh -uh. If there's anybody who we want up your house, you can be black. And some words in there. I didn't know I could put a face in there. Maybe I could adult only. Because as they say, XCXX. <laughs> yeah. Oh, shoot. My sound's cutting out again. Hey, Daigo. Do you have your numbers in? I don't think you do. <laughs> got my robot voice on. Yeah. I've only got one bar. Okay. Here we go. Let's Okay. Blackout. Blackout game. All right. 
So y'all can hear now. I only am showing one bar on my thing. All nine numbers. See, you tell each other what to do. I see some new names in here. I have here. I'm thrilled you're here, but we need that we can play. I got here quick before Miss Morgan hits me. Find something to throw. She's got to find something to throw at me. Luckily, the dog <laughs> knocked everything off uh, the everything table yesterday. Yes, yes, my fingers. My internet is crap. Oh, give me some numbers. Give me some numbers. Oh, there's nothing to do. Well, am I back yet? Am I back yet? <laughs> I will show when. Deanna says you're back. So we're better now? We're better now? It's still only showing one bar. Okay. Okay. Yeah, the delay is, is bad. And see, some weeks are perfectly fine, and other weeks. So this is what she won. We have, let me see, I'll show you one and I'll read one. How about that? Premier, here it is, Premier Wool Free Brights. It's so pretty. Can you see all the different colors? This is a sock weight, super fine yarn. It is machine wash thumb dry from Premier Yarns, made in Turkey, User, so adult dating app. That's one of the words we need to put in that thing. Adult dating site. Come on. Did we get him? Did we get him? Talk user. <laughs> they can hear you now, too. <laughs> Oh, it's XYZ. That's what we'll have to do next time. XYZ? Mm -hmm. XYZ, an adult dating site. We we'll love chat. <laughs> Here, let's write a few of those little I phrases. Got you got them? <laughs> She's writing the phrases down, so I'll go in there and add those to the whack a troll list. Yeah. Yep, we will. I'll put that, I'll add that to it. Okay, so it's wool free, and thank you, Dinky, and it is... How many yards? How many? 235 yards. So you're going to get two of them. So this is enough to make a pair of socks or some little, um, it's got a recipe on here for a cute hat. Can you, there we go. There, isn't that pretty? That's a pretty little hat. I like that. Very, very pretty. And it's, it's a, it's a dark gray and a lighter gray. And then the, the green, pretty, pretty, pretty. Okay, Daigo, let's, I'll check and see if I got your numbers. I got them. We got your numbers. Your numbers are good. You're good to go. So next week, Daigo, your name will be on the list, and that's how you can tell that you're on there. Kim Crochet, did we get your colors? Your colors. Did we get your numbers, Kim? So this is what you won. And I'll, 
put that thing up again so where you know to send me an email because I've got a special email for winners only. Winners only. Hardly. Okay. Everybody got there? Any of the new people that don't have numbers in? We're going to be starting here in a second. Where did... Mama knows best. I know we've got you. Love chat. Oh, here's another one. We missed one. Block. Oh, no. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. How do I get him off of there? Here, hide. <laughs> All right. So does everybody have numbers in? Everybody that wants to play has numbers in. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, let's do it. Ready, set, go. We're playing blackout. And you have to match all nine of your numbers. The first one with a bingo wins. Make sure you say bingo, bingo, bingo. And only one winner. The first one. The email is, I can't remember. I have to wait till it comes up. It's rwrrobin3 at gmail. I'll put it down here. rwrrobin3 at gmail.com. Okay. So I just put that. That's the winner email. Winner owner. E winner owner. Winner owner. Winner owner email. All right. Let's play. Let's play. 66. 66. Let's get started with 66. Make sure you go into those thummies. I don't know why, but it makes YouTube happy. Six, six. Did you win yet, Dana? When I was running all my errands today, I swung by um, Panera. They've got these new lemonades. Have you seen them? They're called charged lemonade. They've got a little caffeine in them. They say they've got a lot of caffeine in them. I haven't noticed, but gee, maybe that's why I can't go to sleep at night, you think? Mm-mm-mm. Oh, Dana's got, Dana is playing a new game called Reverse Blackout. So she won already because she's got no numbers. Nice try. Number 16, one, six, 16. It's so funny when they first put these out, they're like, it has as much caffeine as five Red Bulls. And I'm like, I doubt it. I doubt it. And then the other day when I got one is now the sign says as much caffeine as a cup of our regular coffee. I'm like, that's more like it. It has 388 milligrams of caffeine in it. 388 milligrams. So what's that compared to a cup of coffee? I don't know. Red Bull is 112. Oh, my God. I should be bouncing off the walls, and I'm not. And I have these a couple times a week. How many does it have? 388 milligrams. In the large? Yeah. Okay. So there's a little bit of... 30 at night right now. <laughs> Apparently, there will be no sleeping tonight either. Because apparently this has 388 grams of caffeine in it. Okay. Hmm. Who knew? It's good. Tastes like juice. Mmm. Ah. 
No, you wouldn't think that'd be too good for my heart, Jamie. 22, 2, 2. Well, I didn't think it, I never thought of it as an energy drink. It's lemonade. It's cranberry apple lemonade. <laughs> crack to energy drink. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, I, the, the closest Panera is way across town. So I only can get it once or twice a week. And usually I get it in the middle of the day when I'm driving around. But I already had a Pepsi because, you know, there's no caffeine in this much Pepsi either, right? Again, and she wonders why she doesn't sleep at night. Um, so I already had a Pepsi going. <laughs> Jennifer. Oh, my gosh, Jennifer. That is awesome. It's equivalent to four cups of coffee. <laughs> Uh, maybe it said four, not one. <laughs> yeah, I'd say. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Okay. Yeah, first thing in the morning. That is awesome. <laughs> okay, number four. Number four. Yeah, I've heard that, Mama G. Mm. Yeah, I'm not supposed to drink energy drinks. I was told a long time ago they're not good for me. I didn't think of it as an energy drink. It was just lemonade. I'm bad. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, Morgan already works nights, so apparently I'm going to also. This is what she does for fun on her day off. Hang out with us. Yeah. Oh, you mean like right now? Quit drinking it? It's too late. You've already committed. It's all right. <laughs> Number 50. <laughs> Five, zero. Yeah, for sure. Definitely squirrel. Hmm. Yeah, that's something to think about, Dina. <laughs> Five zero. Karen thinks I should save it for the morning. What? what? <laughs> uh, Thirty-two. Three, two. Maybe I'll have an opposite effect. And he'll just go right to sleep after that. Yeah, it'll be, it'll be. Like reverse. It'll be like Dana playing bingo. It's reverse yeah. on me. <laughs> I used to get uh, lattes. I used to teach, um, teach at night. And I would teach evening classes. And I always got a latte. And I wouldn't get done till 10 at night. And, you know, I'd get a, a quad and drink on it all night it was basically my dinner and i never had a problem going to sleep but i have noticed in the last probably two years the little and it's not like oh it's six o'clock i can't drink caffeine but i've definitely noticed that if i drink something like that that late oh really jennifer no see that's why i only get one or two a week Jennifer says the sugar is horrific as well. Well, I mean, if you're already committing to the caffeine. Yeah. There you go. 32. My late husband used to wake up in the middle of the night. He was a truck driver also. And he used to wake up in the middle of the night, make a pot of coffee, you know, one in the morning, make a pot of coffee, drink the whole thing, and then go right back to bed. I never knew anybody drink as much coffee as that man did. He would... I'll bet you we easily made eight to 10 pots of coffee every day. Every day. <laughs> P 
Poor Dana. No. We're keeping an eye on her numbers. 20, sorry, 71. 71. I thought that 23 was flashing. Oh, it was before. 71. 7-1. Aw, <laughs> oh, Dana, are you wore out tonight? Did you have a long day? Where are you? Where are you, Miss Dana? 71. Eleven, number eleven. Eleven. Uh oh, Lulu's not feeling good. Oh, that's so pretty there. All right, Jennifer got one. Woohoo! So did Christine. 11. 46. 4, 6. 46. Well, I did not start any new projects this week. Ooh, three numbers. Woohoo. Lulu's got one. Mama's got three. Oh, this knee is done. Okay. 46. I was so proud of myself. I did not start any new projects this week. Sharon, you're here now. Let's all double check. Oh, me. I'll double check. <laughs> that means I'll look at Morgan and she'll double check. Make sure I've got your numbers. Uh-huh. Sharon? Sharon? Sharon Motley? Mm -hmm. Sharon, we have your numbers. So just look at the screen and see what you got. We're playing blackout. We. You got plenty of time, girl. You got plenty of time. Oh, now what is it, Melanie? What is it? What's this cow? I'm trying to avoid cows because I there's too many going on and I want to do them all. And okay, good night, Carly. We'll see you next week. I hope you pop in tomorrow for the for the interview with um, Yarn Barf. That's eight o'clock Pacific. Feel better. I'm trying not to start any new cows because I know I won't keep up with them. And I've got so many that I've started and haven't, haven't followed through with. So I'm trying to stay away from those for now. Um, but tell me about it. Tell me what you're doing. 68, 6-8. Awesome, Carly. 68. Oh, no. Run and get it. Go plug it in. Thanks. Sixty-eight. Number three. Turbulent sky shot. Oh, that sounds beautiful. Any weight yarn from one to three, one day a week for only four weeks. Ugh. Now I'm going to have to find it. Tell me who it is again. Three for Tammy M. Spring. I love shawls. Okay. 
Amber's got four numbers. What? You're just sneaking right in there. So does mama. Maybe it won't take as long tonight as it normally does. Did I hit a number? There it is. 60. Six zero. 60. Six zero. Amber, I'm sending you a messenger message. Number six, Angela. <laughs> watch out, watch out, Amber. Dana's slipping you a Mickey. Didn't you just slip her one a little while ago? Are you going to fall asleep on us like you did last time, Dana? Were you here when she fell asleep? Was that last week or the week I before? Last week, probably. Yeah. All of a sudden, we weren't hearing from Dana anymore. She was out. <laughs> Oop, Deb's got two. Deb's got two. All right, the cell phone is charging. You are good to go, Daigo. I know I have to keep, especially um, my new phone, I have to keep it plugged in all the time or it's just gone. Number two. <laughs> Build immunity to Dana's Mickeys. Hey, you guys, just so you know, next week, make sure you pop in for bingo. We are going to have a sponsored night. Miss Amber from Foster and Crochet is going to be sponsoring the prizes for next week's bingo. Woohoo! Thank you so very much. Um, if any of you are interested in sponsoring, you are more than happy to connect with me and um, we'll bring you up on panel and you get to play along and be our guest for the evening or not if you don't want to, if that's something you have no interest in doing. Um, we'll just mention your name and your channel a whole bunch of times throughout the night. Either way, it's a good way to get up here and get some um, little bit of exposure for your channel. So just connect with me and um, we'll get you on the list also. But yeah, and this is, excuse me, this is Miss Amber's second time. She had so much fun the first time, she couldn't wait to do it again. We love, love, love having her up here. The only one crazier than me is her. Well, I don't know. Dana's pretty crazy too. The three of us together. Can you even imagine? Can't even imagine. There it is. 51, 5, 1, 51. Dinky, why are you going on holiday and missing all the fun stuff? Five, one. Ah. That's assuming she's well enough. Poor thing. And she has been run through the ringer. Oh, good, Tammy. That'll be fun. The more the merrier. Get your kid. Get your moms. Get your spouse. Get your dog. As long as they've got a channel, your dog can play. Jack Jack needs his own channel. Wouldn't that be fun? Jack Jack hits the road. Oh, Scotland. Oh, I'm so excited for you. You have my permission to miss all the things. 
that's gonna be wonderful. It's so cool when you get to see, I love seeing the US, I love seeing the rest of the world. That's the thing in October we're doing, um, we've got a trip booked, oh my gosh, a year and a half. We've had this thing booked and wasn't even sure if it was gonna happen especially with Mr. being sick here the last little bit, he's doing so much better all of a sudden, just so much better. Um, so I was afraid we we're going to have to cancel our trip and he's insisting that he'll be fine. But yeah, that's going to be so much fun going to Scotland. That's wonderful. Nine numbers to go. <laughs> <laughs> are you bringing back a bunch of yarn i hadn't even thought about the yarn oh my gosh <laughs> oh we have a bingo you just snuck right in there on us Nope. Where did it go? Where did it go? this darn thing? Let me get up here. Let me get up here. There. This is the one I want. Bingo. All right. Maritza. Wow, that was fast. Okay, let's do a number check. Got to have all nine numbers. There's only 19 numbers called. We're looking for your numbers. Uh-oh, Maritza. Are you on the list? Are you on the list, Maritza? No list. Oh, she's on the list. Okay, I'm, I'm ready. Three. Three. Eleven. Eleven. Seventeen. No. Right. No. Twenty-seven. 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 Oh. But we got to have them all. No. Honey, Maritza, this is blackout. You have to have all nine. Sorry. That's okay. That's okay, Maritza. Not a problem. Not a problem. So that means you're almost there. No problem. No bingo for you. Okay. That's why we double check these things. 27. Okay. Number 42. 4, 2. 42. Five to go, two numbers. Got one. Tammy got one. Woo! -hoo. 42. 26. Two, six. 26. I know, I know, Dinky. It seems like you either get a bunch or hardly any. Oh, Tammy's got six of them. Tammy's getting there. Tammy's getting there. Fifty-two. Five, two. Fifty-two. Fifty-two. Ooh, good job, Dago. Good job. Here comes Mr. In making a bunch of noise. Five, two. All right, Sabrina got a second one. Seven, two, 72. 72. <laughs> 
Nope, not playing horseshoes or hand grenades. Okay, praying for your mother-in-law, Daigo. Hope that goes well and hope it works for her the way the way they're hoping. 72. Woo, Dinky Crafts cranking out beanies. I know, I was looking at my yarn yesterday thinking I need to start a hat. 63. 63. 63. Ooh, good job, Terry. 63. Ooh, Mama Gwen's got five. Number nine. Okay, so y'all remember last Tuesday, Dana had her creator's giveaway party the other, the other day, the other night. And it looks like she's sneaking in another one. Fall giveaway party, November 1st. November 1st. She rocked out. She had like 200 people in there. Amber's got seven. Woohoo! Number nine. That was a lot of fun. And I won one of the prizes. I was pretty excited about that. Sixty-four. Six four. Sixty-four. Is anybody else as close as Amber? Amber's got seven. Mama Sue's got four. Linda only needs two. Okay, let's see what we got here. 41. 4, 1. Tammy's got seven. So we got two people on the board. Two people up for only need one. Oh no, that's seven, not nine. Duh. So you need two more. Tammy and, and Amber both need two more numbers. Okay. Mama only needs three. Thirty-seven. Three seven. Thirty-seven. Well, Mr. Max is talking. <laughs> and Doris still has one. How can you only have one? Most of the... <laughs> Heidi's firing her numbers. 67. Good night, KB. I hope you pop in tomorrow. Six, seven. <laughs> Max, Doris says hi. He hasn't been in bothering as much tonight. It's because he's not so cool. Mm. On the deck. Well, he's, yeah. they've been out on the deck. 48, 48. Whack a troll, whack a troll. Adult dating. Adult dating. Oh, 
I wonder what makes him the best adult dating site. Why is he better than any of the others? Just wondering. No, not cl <laughs> not clicking any links. No, 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 no. Whack a troll. Seventy-three, seven, three. Oh, and I got to go look at Spring's thing. It's all I need is start another project. I'm not allowed. Seven, three. 65. Look at all those 60s called. 65. <laughs> Amber, I so want to look at the list and see what your numbers are. I don't even have the list, so there's no way I can be claimed to be cheating. You you got a buddy up to Morgan. No more 60s, huh? Okay, let's see what we get. Dana. Dana has three numbers. She thinks she's winning. And, <laughs> uh, 18. One, eight. 18. One, eight. All right, Dana got a number. 25, 25. Oh, Dina only needs two numbers now. We got a few people in the running. Dinky, Dinky's got five. 25. Oh, there goes Mr. Running Water. Wouldn't be alive if he wasn't running water. I swear he does it on purpose. Mm-hmm. 47, 47. Forty seven. Forty seven. Oh, Morgan's got six. Woohoo. Kim. Yeah, that seems to be a theme around here. Just ask uh, Dana. Oh, Amber got one. She's got one number left. Sixty-nine. Six nine. <laughs> Does I help anybody? Sixty-nine. Lori says bingo, bingo, bingo. Let's see. Let's see. Ready? Uh, ready. Three. Three. Four. Four. Eighteen. Twenty-five. Twenty-five. Thirty-two. Thirty-two. Thirty-eight. Thirty-eight. Uh, Forty-two. Forty-two. Sixty. Sixty. Sixty-nine. Sixty-nine. You win! Yay! Well, she snuck right in there. I don't remember her telling us she had a million numbers on the board. Where's my little thingy? Woo-hoo! Yay! 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 You're not going to ring the bell? The bell hurts the dog's ears. Well, Mr. says we need to ring the bell because, you know, it was the uh, blackout. Nice, nice, nice. Very cool. Very, very cool. <laughs> yeah, that way, that way, if you don't talk about it, then Dana can't slip you a Mickey. <laughs> Dana, 
very old. You know, that's a good idea. When you're getting that close, make sure you've got uh, bingo typed in so you can get it. Congratulations, Lori. Did we get her name marked down for price three? So don't forget tomorrow at eight o'clock Pacific, we've got an interview with Chrissy from Yarn Barf. We're excited about that. And then sometime in the next day or two, I'm going to get a video posted about the upcoming Mosaic live Mosaic class with Michelle Mosaic and more. And what did she win? This beautiful skein of summer nights. This is so pretty, you guys. Summer nights yarn. It's called Castaway. It's beautiful. All different shades of blues with silver um, spun through it. Can you see that silver in there? It is so pretty, 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 pretty. This is super fine knit one. It's 82% acrylic, 18% polyester. 437 yards. Yeah, 437 yards. So that is enough for a nice project. And machine wash and dryable from Lion Brand Yarn. And I'm not seeing where it is made. I cannot see it. So that's your beautiful, beautiful. That is so pretty. Look at the colors in that thing. I just love the way the silver sparkles in that. Oh, so, so nice. So yeah. make sure that you get that. Um, send me an email and you've got until next Sunday to claim your prize. And then I get that out pretty quick. I get it out pretty quick. Um, we have um, probably Thursday I'll be making a trip to the post office. So that would be nice. Prayers. We've got a lot of people that are needing some prayers. And we've got several surgeries. And then, of course, we've had a couple people in here that have lost someone recently. So let's keep keep everybody in our prayers. Make sure that we have good wishes. Good wishes for everybody who needs it. Thank you guys ever so much for popping in tonight. I cannot tell you how much I appreciate it. 1275. Yes, Linda, or you'll need to change your number if you've got 77 picked. I'm sorry, I didn't notice that. I usually pay attention to that. Oh, I'm so sorry. I highlighted that on my sheet. Okay, we'll change that to 75 if that's okay with you. We'll make that a 75. Yes, prayers for everybody in our Yarny community. I'm going to go check out Springs um, Crochet Along. And we'll see y'all tomorrow. Bye-bye.